How's it going, everybody? This is Beat the Bush. These are the MagTame's magnetic USB cables. If you pull it apart and put it back together, it easily sticks back together very neatly. It comes in any permutation you'll ever want. On one end, it can be USB-A, USB-C. On the other end, it can either be Lightning or USB-C. Comes in black, silver, blue. I have seen other cables with specific points of magnetism along the cable, so it can only lock in one particular way. This one, you can just slide it open and you can lock it in at any diameter that you want. The cable is slightly flat, on one side, it's all North Pole. On the other side, it's all South Pole. The dark green line means it's the highest magnetism. If I turn it to its side, you can see there's a top side and a bottom side. So if you orient it correctly, they would actually nest together. It even stays up on its own. But if you try to flip it, well, it doesn't stay in there. Unfortunately though, there is a very, very slight downside. This OMAG cable is actually three times the weight of this simpler cable that's not magnetic. You see, I tied it together with a little rubber band. It's certainly not as neat, but it's 0.65 ounces versus this one, which is 1.95 ounces. I've always liked braided cables because they feel like fabric rather than you touching some plastic piece. This cheaper one, it feels horrible to the touch. It kind of feels like a very hard snake and it's just not very pleasant to touch this thing. The braided cable has a very nice feel to it. Each side of the molded plastic is very thick and heavy duty. You have a power adapter with a USB-C port above a USB-A or a couple of ports in a row. You can actually stack these cables on top of each other and the cable would naturally stick together north pole to south pole, making it very neat and turning it into one single cable. I have wound it tightly instead of one much smaller than another, and it just stays together like magic. Pull it apart. The ones I have here are three amp capable, but they do have 60 watt or even 240 watt capable cables. If you guys are interested in making your cable life a lot neater, check out my affiliate link down in the video description below. Thanks for watching this video. Until next time.